Hey guys, back for another video. I want to welcome my subscribers to my channel. Thank you guys for all of your support. And if you are new to this channel, welcome. Make sure you guys hit that notification bell so you are notified when we do upload videos. Also, if you like the content, please go ahead and hit that thumbs up. It helps me determine what videos to post and what videos not to post. And also let me know what you guys think in the comments. So guys, I like I said, I read the comments. That's why I love, you know, for you to comment, obviously respectfully. And you guys have been speaking on this for some time now. And I just decided to talk about it. When I originally found out about um, the revenge porn with regard to Martel Hope and Melody Hope, of course, I didn't want to believe it because that's really a very bad thing. And just to think, you know, Melody going through that, not only you know, going through a divorce, needing to work out arrangements with the court and everything, but also to be put on blast by somebody that she used to love and the revenge part is that he just wants to pretty much come at her because she doesn't want him anymore. So that was a little bit hard for me, although, you know, it's not my situation. I could just imagine you know how she was feeling and it's just it's, it's traumatic but you know to have people come out and basically say that is exactly what he was trying to do to her and then he in so many words confessed it in with his own mouth um, some of the things he stated but I'm not this video is not to talk about that particular incident the reason why I'm bringing it up because it's reminding me of someone, right? We have another lady out there, Brianna Hampton, Miss LaTruth, whatever she wants to call herself. And when I think about Martell and what he did to Melody Hope, you guys, you want to, let me tell you what comes to my mind. <laughs> because Martell Hope, he attempted to release a tape on his wife, but Brianna Hampton, Miss Crazy LaTruth, she actually went online <laughs> and released pictures of her husband and she was arrested for it. And you guys can go to my YouTube channel and read the video. I mean, watch the video. I've already put that on there. But the reason why I have her on the screen is because these two, Martell Holt and Brianna Hampton, are very similar. This lady went on a crusade last year. Was it last year? Yeah. Basically saying that her husband beat her. The interesting part, and again, go to my YouTube channel and, and, and watch that video. I don't want to talk about that particular video here. But when I first saw the video as a woman, I was compelled to listen to what she said because, hey, she said that her husband beat her. As I continued to pay attention, I said, this lady is not making a lot of sense. A lot of what she's saying is not really adding up, you know? But who wants to believe that, you know, the person is a liar? As I continue to watch her videos and, you know, the things that she was saying about her husband, I realized that this later lady is most definitely a liar. Nothing about her story is adding up. Then the constant attacks over and over to a man that she states has beat her. 
There's no police reports. He's never been to jail. So we can only conclude one thing, that she's a liar. She's a liar, similar to Martel Hope. And eventually, well, I won't say eventually, but people are starting to figure this chick out. And her world is coming down fast around her because she created a narrative and she lied for clout, for clicks, and for views. And for that, Miss Brianna, your day is coming. But the most interesting part about this, when I think about her and Martell, do you know what comes in my mind? <laughs> this is what comes to mind. I think these two would make a great couple. They're definitely two narcissists, right? Two narcissistic people. They fight the same. When they're upset and they don't get what they want, they behave in the exact same way. We call these kindred spirits. So let me just tell y'all what a kindred spirit is. <laughs> Because this, this is what came to my mind. A person whose interests or attitudes are similar to one's own. I would say these two belong together. She has four children. He has five children. She's a narcissist narcissistic, crazy, lunatic, deranged. And he is the exact same. I think these two make the most greatest couple. Think about it. They would be doing the same thing to each other. What these two people have done to their ex-partners who no longer even want to be around them is just terrible. It's just absolutely terrible. And I had to post this video because when I thought of him and what he did to Melody, I thought of her and how she is still trying to destroy a man who don't even want to go and pick up his child from her. I can imagine that that is very hard. And I know Melody is dealing with the same thing. You two are abusive. And honestly, you need to spend some time in jail. You utilize the legal system and the court system for the wrong reason. But I think... You two, I think this is a match made in hell. <laughs> Y'all need each other. So she can leave her ex-husband alone who filed for divorce. Same thing happened to him. Melody left him alone and filed for divorce. These two deserve each other. <laughs> Let me know what y'all think in the comments. Don't forget to like, share, subscribe, and I'll see y'all in the next video.